We've been running since 1985. Congratulations, you are now a member. Running for the House and the Senate, Governor and Attorney General, Secretary of State, State Legislature, Mayor, and everything in between. Running to protect abortion, defend our democracy, and build a future in which our children and families can thrive, and where our communities flourish. We've been moving our country forward and passing the baton along the way. As women in politics, we know we have to run faster, run stronger, run smarter. We are not going to let them treat us like second-class citizens. Just to get on the ballot, get through the primary, and get in the room where decisions are made. And that's why we recruit, train, and coach. Recruit women from all backgrounds to run for office train staff on how to combat disinformation and raise money for candidates, and coach candidates on how to build competitive campaigns so that we can change the world and our communities by repealing outdated abortion laws, signing gun safety legislation, and bringing the black maternal health crisis to the forefront. They don't make it easy. Not, this is important. Susan, I, and I, I want to add, if Mr. Vice President, I'm speaking. I have I'm speaking. Up. But we keep running. This is the mightiest movement in the land. So I just want to recount what we've been through to get to this point. Because the future we want demands it. And in the decade that began with the election of our first Madam Vice President, we're on track to win the decade with women. And our voice will always be heard in this country. Women will run. Our work is far from over. Women will win. And women will change the world.